Hey, what's going on? It's your boy BT. We're at the illustrious Delray Beach Boxing Club here in South Florida. You're watching True School Sports. <laughs> Brendan Taylor here, True School Sports. I'm with my main man, Gamal Yafai. How you doing, champ? Good, how are you? I can't complain, man. Good to see you again. Oh, no. You yep. following me, yeah? Yeah, yeah. A little bit, a little bit. Um, how do you I mean? How do you feel about your, your brother's fight this weekend? I'm excited. I've seen the hard work he's put on the past three months, mm -hmm. and he's sick. He's really serious about his fight. So yeah, I see a very good performance out there. You're in the gym every single day. So like, is there is there anything you can maybe tell people about? Just I guess his preparation and and how just focused he's, he is. Just, he's trying really hard. He's trying, you know, like it's out on all count. Been moving through all the caps and fight nights and whatever, and then I can see how serious he is and how he's took training really long to and whatever. Um, so yeah, I'm expecting it. And still, sadly not. Yeah, I've heard in the past Cal say like sometimes he fights down to the level of, of, of his opposition. So do you feel like maybe in training camp he's revved it up a bit? Or? Yeah, and I think uh, Gonzalez will get the best out of him. So, mm. um, so uh, just, that's the main thing. We need a fight who's gonna get the best out of Calvin. So I think he's a man who's out there, so um, yeah, I expect Cal to win. You know. how, how good do you think he'll he, I mean, this fight's gonna tell us a lot about Cal your fight, but how, how good do you think he could be, Cal? I think no one's in the best of him yet. Um, and like I said on Saturday night, he's in the best. This will put him on another level of stardom and, you know, um, people finally realize, you know what, he's just, uh, he just, when he won the world title, he looked great, it's, it, you know, he's still, he ain't get, just because he's 30, he ain't getting on, he's still, he's got better, he's better than anything, so, um, you know, I'm, uh, I'm excited for Saturday night, because I'm, it's going to prove a lot of doubt is wrong in the yeah, UK yeah. and, you know, um, and in America, so. How, how do you feel about the doubters? Because I know a lot of people are doubting Cal Yafai going into the fight. See, the thing is with Cal, Cal's mm -hmm. one of them who's like, he, he don't care what people think of him. Mm -hmm. He just kind of is, you know, quiet. Even on social media, he just keeps out to himself. Um, you know, worry, worry that box at his family and that's it. He don't worry about social media, mm -hmm. you know, so on, so. That's, a, that's how you, too, too, too many fighters get too much into social media yeah. and it gets to them, you know, when people, you know, because you're going to get it, people are going to talk all yeah, and they're going to stand off and bar, so you can't win. Um, but Cal, good job, Cal, just blanked all that and, um, you know, just carry on grafting, but I see it, you know, yeah, yeah. I see it, but, you know, um, it pisses me off a bit, you know, because what he's done for Birmingham, what he's done, you know, for, in boxing in general, he's a, you know, he's a world champion, Britain was the longest reigning world champion. Mm -hmm. On Saturday night, all them, all them people that were slagging him off and he had that good and he wouldn't, wouldn't give you to Chocolato, Gonzalez, we we'll see Saturday night. Is there anything you saw that really stood out and you said that, that really pissed you off about people slagging him off? I didn't. Is there anything that you saw on social media or just in the media just, that... Just, you know, that you see on Twitter and, you know, people, but you get that when you're, you know, when you're, when you're a decent profile boxer and, you know, pe people's, you get to see people warriors. Yeah, You're yeah. going to get it, no matter who you are, you know, probably since loads of top fighters on Twitter get, you know, like you know, Anthony Joshua, Tyson Fury, all of them, so you can't win, but... Like you say, people get too involved in social media yeah. and it, it, you know, dead so confident in that. Luckily, come with all that. Sometimes the fighters become Instagram fighters, so it's better to be a real fighter than be an Instagram fighter. Yeah, in social media is good, now, especially now in this day and age, you know, powerful and that. But I think when these world champions they get to a certain level, I know why they get to that, you know, high level, they don't really need to rely on social media because they're fighting big fights, they're making big money anyway, but, you know what I mean? Yeah, you could be on social media and getting an extra five, five, ten thousand followers and that, but it's not about that now. They've got to us. They've got to the position where they don't need to rely on that. So I think Cal's got the position where you don't, you don't want about social media. So it's about his boxing and that's it. Because the boxing's going to pay off and the boxing's going to pay his bills. You know, okay. So you can live a life after boxing. So what's your? Uh, if you had a prediction, what would, what would be your final prediction for Cal? Oh, Mark. Being honest, I'd, I'd expect Cal to beat him in points. 
But I won't be surprised if Cal not be I won't be surprised because Cal's got the bit between his teeth and he's looking strong and I just think like... I know people laugh and whatever but, you know, you can interview again. Interview me I will, again, I will, after the fight. After the fight, After yeah. the fight, okay. So, yeah. Alright, come on. And you're fighting soon. I know you're fighting yeah, soon. March 27th uh, for the European tour. So. In Italy, that's the lawn, right? Yeah. That's well, well, yeah, it's on, but at the moment, but, you know, I'm, I'm expecting the worst. So. Okay. Alright, well, Gamal Yafai. Uh, any message to the boxing world about Cal Yafai and what you got going on as well? Yeah. What, what do you want me to do? Just, just any message, anything you want to say to an interview, anything. Um, anything. It could be anything you want. Just. just just thank you for, for any boxers that do support us. Yeah. Um, you know, uh, bad luck, man. You know what I mean? We appreciate it. Okay. So there you go. Gamal, your five. One of Boxer's True Warriors. Thank Cheers. you, champ. Cheers. Let's go, champ. It's the champ, Shannon and Cannon Briggs. And you're watching True School Sports. Let's go, champ. When I make myself crystal clear, you fit to keep feel when I lace you up in Zaire. Tusk with a lasso in the Royal Rumble. Jungle. 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 Jungle.